This is the new motion computing J3500 tablet computer. It is a um, significantly enhanced version of last year's J3400 product. Uh, what you don't see here is that the processors have been switched to the new Intel Core i5 and i7 processors, which makes the machine faster and also more power efficient. But what I want to show you here today is that as probably a first, you can get a dual digitizer um, option on this machine that combines a, capacity, a projected capacitive touch uh, digitizer, basically the same technology that's available on the iPhone and the iPad with the standard Wacom digitizer and I want to show you how this works. Okay, as you can see this, the uh, machine responds to my fingers, my hands. I'm going to show you a demonstration here of the Microsoft Collage software. Microsoft Surface Collage and I can grab one of those things, pictures move it around, take another finger and I can move two of them around separately. Now I can also pinch and expand and rotate these things just as I would on an iPhone. I can do two but I cannot do three. I cannot grab one of them and the second one and then the third one too. It only responds to two inputs just like on the iPhone. Now let's see how this works in some other applications. There's for example Microsoft's Surface Globe application and that would come in handy for geographic information system, GPS mapping applications and you can see here is the world and I can pinch and expand drag things around just like on the iPhone I can turn it, rotate it like that's very smooth and zoom in to California here or Yuba City Sacramento area and you can see how quick that goes, no problem at all zoom in rotate any which way. It's a very elegant solution. Now the interesting thing is that you can use both your hands and the pen at the same time and the system knows which, uh, which input method you're using. Let me demonstrate how this works. Like here for example we have a uh, simple Microsoft Paint program. I can use the, the pen to write or I can use my fingers to write. I can even use two fingers at the same time. Okay, so now if I let me get a, a new file here. Okay, so if I write and I use my finger, nothing happens. If I move the pen away, all of a sudden I can use the finger. If the system senses the pen again, finger no longer offers input and the pen works. As simple as that. If we use text, we can use the standard Microsoft input panel with a keyboard. Either with the pen or my fingers again. I can also resize this keyboard any which way I want. Or I can use handwriting recognition. So there you have it. Uh, combination of different technologies, the iPad style capacitive, um, projected capacitive touch technology with the Wacom technology makes this an incredibly flexible new machine.